Hey guys, welcome back to more Job Tree Dash. In today's episode, we're going to take on more levels in the main game. Now, I've actually figured out a solution for the audio problem that you may or may not have heard recently. But, um, it turns out there's actually an option where I can... There's actually a way I can change the thing so that it records the, the game audio pretty well. But as a sacrifice, I have to turn down the I have to turn down the game volume like here really really low, so I can barely hear anything. But it doesn't matter. Well, actually, I can I can still hear it, so it's fine. I mean, I can still hear it, but in the game, I mean, in the video, it'll be a lot louder and a lot more clearer. So hopefully that sound audio is fixed. <clears throat> and in today's episode, we're gonna start off straight away with Can't Let Go, the next hard. So let's go. All right. So it starts off with your typical, you know jumping segment. This is where the orbs start to break you a lot. This is also where the game starts to get pretty tough, actually. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. I, I will admit, this, this is where things start to get pretty hard now. Like that. <laughs> no, but yeah. Things do get, things do start to get kind of tough now. I will admit, like, you know, it's not very easy anymore. So, I will be dying quite a bit from now. Like that. <laughs> Come on, I can do this. Okay. Alright, come on, come on, I can do this. There we go. <sighs> For fuck's sake. I think the problem is, like, when I'm talking too much, I don't really concentrate as much. And also, I have not played this level in quite a long time, actually. In fact, I think I've actually done this level with like all the coins straight away, so I never came back to it, ever. So I'm kind of rusty. Quite rusty, I should say. There we go. Now, this bit's pretty easy, actually. <clears throat> Not even pretty, it's really easy. So you know, it's not bad. It's it's not bad at all. Alright, uh, now we have a plane segment. So yeah, like I said, there's nothing really introduced in this level. It's just hard stuff, but you know, it's just harder, really. I guess. And now we have a, a really crazy bit right here. This this bit can get you at first quite a lot, but it's actually not that. the lag, man. So you throw your triple spike right at that, right at the end. <clears throat> but with that, <clears throat> can't let go is done. Four attempts, so it could have gone a lot smoother, but whatever, it's fine. Now we're going to move on to the first harder of the game, Jumper, level 7. Let's do it. <clears throat> so, you know, it starts off pretty easy with this whole jumping segment. Nothing a whole lot hard, you know, it's just typical jumping is. Now we have a little upside down segment straight away and I just jumped. <laughs> no, but you know, it's not bad. It, it's not bad at all. Alright, it's not it's not really that bad. Oh god, this lag. It was not like this yesterday, I swear. Oh well. Alright, now we have a now we have the next gimmick. Upside down flying, which I, which it, which happens, well, which appears a lot in this game. Loads of levels do this, and it's really annoying. Now in this part, I always go for the coin route, so I can do that. Now we have this bit. This bit's really easy. There's a coin at the bottom which you can get, but I'm not bit bothered because I already got it. <laughs> Fuck! I knew that would get me. I knew that would get me. <sighs> okay. I'll, I'll just cut out some bits and do editing, I guess. That, that, the screen's tearing again. I'm not sure why that happens. I'm pretty sure I'll fix that. Oh, 
this is an option. I guess, I guess, uh, I, I think I didn't, like, do the thing. <coughs> tough oh man even though i only beat in three attempts but hey jump up there we go that that things get a little tough from now but hey not that bad all right next up oh boy this level time machine this is where the new game mechanic comes in and you'll see why in a minute we have now we have triple spikes straight away yeah this gets pretty intense you know I, I need to i need to fix this thing hang on so yeah, like I said before, go here and then I think this is it. Yeah, I think that oh, was this one. Yes, that's it. That's the one. Oh. Okay. Uh, we were at time imaging. All right, now let's try this again. Okay, it's still screwed. Turn it off. Okay. Oh, okay. Forget it. Forget it. Forget all of it. Yeah, it's, it's amazing I can still actually play this. But in the... <clears throat> not just in the playback, none of it is actually showing up. At least I don't think so. I guess I'll find out later, but anyway. So here we come towards our next gimmick of the level. The whole screen flips around. This throws you off a lot in levels. A lot of people tend to do this a lot, and it really throws you off. It, I mean, it definitely threw me off the first time I was playing this. Like, I was not ready for this. <coughs> I knew it. That triple, that triple always gets me. There's quite a lot of triple spikes in this level. Quite a lot of them. <coughs> yeah, this, I can say from here, the level, yeah, this level does get pretty tough. I'd, I'd honestly say, I'd honestly say this level's harder than the next one. I don't know, this level just really, really throws you off a lot. There's a lot of, like, flipping and all that. It's really, really confusing. <clears throat> Music's great, though, I love it. Music's fantastic, but... You know, it's very hard to do. So I'm, I might be here for a little bit, because I, I'm still not really... You know, I, don't, I can't do this level as well as I used to. Almost fucked up right there. Alright, I'm going flipping around once again. Now I know there's a triple spike coming up. I remember. Right here. There's two. One there and one there. This bit sucks. Okay, now I got lost flying bit. Very easy this bit. Holy shit! <laughs> okay, well. <clears throat> you know, besides a couple mess ups, this again was not that bad. Three attempts, you know. It, it gets a little tough, but it's not really hard, I guess. I don't know, but anyway. That's time machine done. Speeding through these. Next is cycles. Ooh, this is gonna be great. Now this is this is where this is actually where the updates of the game started coming in. You know, one to eight is like the is like the vanilla game, I guess. 
this is where new stuff comes in. So we have a new game mode in this level, finally. So, you know, everything else you see as, uh, you know, plain and, plain and cube, this one kind of takes things to the next level and adds the new game mode, which you'll see in just a minute, like right now. <coughs> Here we are. We have the gravity ball. Tap to flip gravity. There we go. It's a very, very cool game mode. I really like this one, but it can get very annoying to use sometimes. Like, so, you know, it, it's very, it can be very uh, interesting. I mean, you have this little section, which is pretty irritating at first, but it's not very hard at all. Right. And then just flip again. Alright, now we have the last, now we have the last four bit. This bit can get you sometimes, because it's very tight. Now, don't trust that jump pad. That jump pad's just a uh, tricky. Don't press that one either. And this is some cool like, things. This is a cool thing to can do with the ball. And with that, we're doing cycles. Like I said, it's, it's easier than Time Machine. It's much easier than Time Machine. I didn't want to attempt. It's pretty easy. It's not very hard at all, honestly. You know, I mean, I can do that really quickly. So. Well, we're going to do one more level. Uh, we're going to be doing X Step, the first insane rated level. Now, this one, this one gets you a lot, actually, and I'll show you why. Okay, first insane rated of uh, as of 1.9, that is, because the difficulties have changed. But as you can see, we just jump straight into the jump straight into ball. It's tapped up. All right, now we have a bit of a plane here. That's an easy corner right there, but I just skip it now because I've already beaten some more, so... Uh, now you have to build up to the hell apart, I should say. <coughs> Alright, here we go. Now, this pit is not that bad, but... You touch that and you fuck up like that. Yeah, you know, maybe I can make it. I've actually never touched those things, but let's see if I can make it, I guess. I'm fucking god if I can do that, holy shit. Now this also introduces the gravity jump pads, as you can see right there. It flips gravity automatically. That can get you so many times, I just, I was not used to that. And I have the little plane bit right at the end. And with that, next step is done. <clears throat> Surprisingly, that wasn't very hard either. Which actually is surprising. I usually never want, I never want to attempt that. Especially that little mess up I did near the beginning where I hit the gravity pad by accident. That was cool. Alright. But yeah, that's next step done. Alright, so that is it for this video. In the next video, we're going to be tackling Clutterfan, Collect Theory of Everything, Electroman. And uh, we're not doing this one until like near the end. We're not gonna do demons yet, so we might we might jump straight to Electro Dynamics, I'm not sure. <clears throat> but thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Where we will probably tackle more uh demon well, we'll just tackle more insanes really. From here on, it's mostly just insanes. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.